Hi everyone, it's Judy Craddock, the Body Confidence Coach from Heart Your Body, and welcome to another episode of Body Confident Friday. Body Confident Friday is where I share with you every Friday one tip to help you feel more comfortable in your own skin. And today's tip is to let your feelings out. When you're experiencing negative thoughts and feelings about your body, it's tempting to try to block them out either by ignoring them or turning to some form of comfort like food or a glass of wine or maybe a shopping spree. But the problem with bottling up your feelings is that it doesn't help you to feel any better. Instead, if you can find a way to let those feelings out, you'll help to lessen their intensity. And when you can do that, you also lessen the impact those feelings have on you. So the next time that you experience some strong negative feelings about your body, try to either say out loud or write down exactly how you're feeling about your body in that moment. And what I thought would be useful is to share with you an entry that I made in my journal not that long ago where I'm actually letting my feelings out about my body. So I'm just going to grab my journal and read the entry to you. So this is what I wrote on a day when I wasn't feeling that great about my body. And this is how I let my feelings out. I really don't like my body today. All these negative feelings about my skin are coming up for me. I'm annoyed with myself that these old feelings are creeping in again, but I know it's perfectly normal to have days like these. The best thing I can do is acknowledge these feelings and be patient. I know that these feelings will pass. So by writing that entry in my journal, I got to let my feelings out and acknowledge them. But you may have also noticed that I gave myself some self-compassion as well. And I did that by recognizing that it's perfectly normal to have feelings like this. And also by recognizing that I just need to trust that you know things will go back to normal. I won't feel this way forever. And I just need to be patient with myself. Now self-compassion is incredibly important to better body confidence. So if you want to know more about that and how you can practice self-compassion, I've got another episode of Body Confident Friday that you can check out. So if you want to check that one out, it's episode number 17. So back to today's episode. Try letting out your feelings in whatever way feels good for you and notice how you feel afterwards. So I'd love to know how do you feel when you actually let your feelings go? Leave me a comment below and don't forget to use the hashtag Body Confident Friday. That's all I've got for you for this week. Until next week, stay body confident and I'll see you then. Goodbye.